hi guys in this video tutorial I am going to teach you how to generate a normal map using GIMP and also how to enhance your normal map using GIMP for this tutorial you must have the following softwares namely GIMP okay it's a free software you can download it from gimp.org you'll find download link over there okay and you must have a normal map filter which is also freely available in nvidia search it as gimp normal map filter in google in NV nvidia textures tools you will find the link to G gimp normal map plugin it takes you to this page where you can download the exe of of the normal map filter okay after installing the normal map you will find the ma normal map filter in maps filter maps normal map okay okay for this tutorial i made some photograph of a very simple image which is also available in this side okay uh, to generate a normal map we need only the black and information of the uh, map we don't want any color information the nvidia plugin um, map filter only generate a normal map only using with the black and white information it does not take the color information so we don't want the color information in this map so i'm going to desaturate it okay and next i want to adjust the the color the intensity of the black and white in this image so i'm going to adjust a level i'm going to adjust it all i'm going to bring the intensity of the black and white very high so we can easily identify the depth information yeah i think it's enough next we are going to operate the number filter to this image so filters maps and you will find normal map i'm not going to give any any changes in this um, filter it's going to be as a default your filters samples will be four i'm not going to change that i'm going on i'm also not going to change the scale value it will be one this is a default value so i'm going to give ok you can see that the normal map has been generated by the nvidia plugin ok this is a default one which is generated by nvidia plugin so now we are going to enhance this on the map so i'm going to make a duplicate of this ok i made some duplicate so i'm going to enhance we let us keep this image that side i'm going to enhance this okay first of all i am going to duplicate this layer so i have duplicated it i'm going to rename this layer as detail layer this layer contains the detailed information of the normal map and this layer contains the depth information sorry depth layer i am going to call this as a depth layer this layer contains a depth information and this layer contains the detail information so i am going to blur this depth information layer filters blur gaussian blur 3 pixels is enough for this so i am going to blur it out we are not going to see any changes so next i am going to in detail information layer i am going to soften it out so going to enhance sharpen going to sharpen up to 42 percentage i think it's not okay it has been sharpened it now what we are going to do is watch it carefully so now i'm going to change the layer mode as gray merge okay i'm going to change the layer mode as a green merge this method I called uh, it as a gain merge method uh, it's it is it's one of the most optimized way to generate a normal map so 
if you want to increase the depth information in this picture you have to duplicate the depth layer so I'm going to duplicate it out so I'm going to duplicate and I'm going to in the layer mode method I'm going to set it as grain merge you can see the depth information has been increased okay I'm going to duplicate it again so you can see again the depth information has been increased if I go on duplicate it again again you can see the depth information is going on increase if you want more detail in this map you can also duplicate the detail layer if you duplicate the detail layer the detail information of the normal map will be increased so you can see the detail layers detail information is increasing so I don't want this detail information this detail is more than enough for me okay you can go on copy the depth layer so that you can get more depth in your normal map I call this method as a grain merge method okay so this is the normal map which is generated default by the NVIDIA plugin you can see it out you can see it out clearly yeah this is the normal map which I generated using uh, grain merge method I kept this method as the name method name as grain merge okay uh, now let us apply this normal map into blender and see the result how it's okay, name it as uh, normal map underscore grain merge with grain merge method with grain merge with grain merge okay I'm going to save it wrong so I'm going to save this under percentage as JPEG usually okay, let's go with uh, Tonga we don't want JPEG usually I don't use JPEG for my projects I usually use Tonga because Tonga is one of the best thing if you use JPEG you may sometimes lose your detail some information in your in your texture files so I advise you to use Targa so I'm going to save this out so this is a less Save it as Tonga. Okay. Now let us apply this two images to do two trees to two two plane. Uh, this very simple scene which I created in Blender. So I made two light over here, then a two plane which is UV map. Okay. Let us apply the normal map to to do to this planes you can see the how it is has been improved so I'm going to apply the normal map so I assigned a shader now so, so I assigned a shader for this next time I'm going to assign a texture in texture type it's an image now I'm going to load the image file okay normal map uh, with grain merge method okay I'm going to load it now I'm going to enable the normal map button I'm going to keep it as a tangent. I'm going to shader then map input. It's it is UV input. Okay, next I map to its normal map. Sorry, I think it's not today. I think I not UV mapped it. So I'm going to make a UV map. So I'm going to uh, go to edit mode. Then I'm going to select each and every faces. Sorry. I'm going to select edit mode. Next, you're going to do UV map. Yeah, this is done. I think I have to cut for this also. So I'm going to back to the edit mode for this plane. I'm going to do UV map for this. Okay. This is the normal map which we generated using grain merge butter. Let us apply the normal map which is used without using the grain merge butter. So as I told you I assign a shader. I'm going to assign a texture and it's a texture type. 
it is uh, gain must normal map without gain much better okay i'm going to enable normal map and give it a armor space as tangent and share a uh, green map input uv and map to which normal okay we need is really of normal now you can see clearly see the difference between the two normals so i can move this light and show you how it is looks you can see the detail which where the depth information and the detail information in this normal map has been increased quite on the, the default settings of nvidia where you can see the normal map is not too uh, good you cannot see more depth into this or more detail okay i can see over here now okay that's it guys this is a method it's a gain merge method if you have any doubt with this method okay you can also you can send me an email i'll clear your doubts have a nice day guys bye